Hi, and welcome to the next episode of CMTV. Coming up, we're going to meet the man behind the new BCM. Watch this. So I'm here with Jaime. Thank you for coming along. Yeah, uh, for those of you who, well, for all the people that don't know you, I'm going to do a small introduction based on what I know. Okay. And then you correct me. Since my time on the island, I've known you to look after a club called Tito's. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, I've never been. I have to apologize. But all my friends have. And especially the ladies love you. So we're going to get on to that later. Um, but what else have you done apart from Tito's? Like, how did you get to Tito's? Okay, I am working for Grupo Cursac in my last uh, 25 years. Wow. It's a long okay. time. Yeah. Uh, first five years I was uh, as manager in uh, Paradis. It was a club in Arenal, Playa de Palma. And after this, uh, Tolo, one, one day, he said, hey Jaime, I need you in, in Titos. At, at, at this moment, Titos was a little bit down. And for me, it was a big uh, pr proud. Uh, I was proud to, to go there because it was the iconic club in Mallorca. Okay. So I, I'm, I'm working in Titos as manager the last 20 years. Wow. And now I think is one of the best club in Spain. Uh, our people, our shows, our decoration, uh, everything is high quality. So I think that's why the people like to come to visit us in Palma, in, in our club, Titos. Okay. Now, there's a lot of questions, obviously, there's a lot of changes happening at BCM. Mm -hmm. With changes come questions. Uh, one question that a lot of people are asking and a lot of rumours that are going around the island is, did you buy BCM or is it still the Cossacks or are you running it or is there a consortium? Who's in charge and who's doing what? Yeah, no. I, I am the manager okay. uh, for, from BCM uh, since uh, last uh, August. Okay. Uh, Tolo, Tolo Kursak, BCM is Bartolome Kursak Mas, yeah. is his name, he is the owner and uh, last year he asked me also to be the manager in BCM. He wants to change totally uh, the club for other people, for um, other style and uh, he thought I was the person to change this club for something uh, new uh, in the same style like Magaluf now want to be. Yes. You know, the renovation of yes. Magaluf. Yes. So uh, I can say that now uh, BCM is probably uh, one club uh, is in the first three or four best club in the world. Yes. Is you can't because, imagine. Yeah, is it because of the renovation? Because of the renovation, he has spent it a lot of money uh, with the renovation, and, and uh, it was me who gave him uh, the ideas. Okay. Uh, now there are so many VIP spaces. Uh, the decoration is t spectacular, very luxury. Um, we don't want to work with the um, cheap people. Okay. Uh, we don't want to work also with the people who want uh, um, an offer like, for example, all-inclusive. Yes. No. We want to give a big quality of shows. We want to give a, a great service. We, we want uh, to be the best club, not only in Mallorca. We want to be the best club in Spain and one of the best club in Europe. Okay. I think uh, we are in the good way. It looks fabulous from the outside. I mean, anybody who's driving past mm. can see all the outside. Now, was that your vision or did you have the help of an architect or is it, you know, who, no. who's, who's uh, responsible? When, 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 when I met with uh, Tolo, uh, he wanted to do something mm, similar like I did in Titos. Okay. Uh, of course, we, we knew about the renovation of Magaluf. With the old style, it was not possible to make it up market. Make up market there. Okay. Uh, so, I, I, in my head, I designed it 
uh, how it's, it will be the okay. new BCM. Yes. After we put on a paper, after I show him, he accepted to make this big change. Yes. And now the club is nearly ready. Yes. Uh, it's uh, spectacular, believe me. Okay. Believe me. And another question that's been asked about the club is obviously inside mm -hmm. there's um, is is the club recognizable or has everything changed so is the DJ box where it was is the VIP the same because people are talking <laughs> about a superior VIP uh, so what changes can you tell us about we when we start the renovation we decided to put all down totally okay. only only the four walls were <laughs> well, in the, are, are in the Everything same place. Yeah. Wow. Okay. And and uh, the DJ box is not anymore where it was before. Okay. Now it's in the front. Okay. And all the bars and all the VIP areas you can see straight. Yes. To the uh, stage and to the DJ. Okay. We have uh, 90 quadrat meters of uh, screen, wow. video screen. Yep. Uh, we have the same lamp, lamp for uh, like uh, in uh, Omnia, Las Vegas. Wow! And uh, the sound is, uh, is perfect before it was. Yes. Uh, but uh, when you go in the inside the club, you just in the hall, you can see totally the difference. Yes. It's nothing, nothing, nothing that reminds you the past. Yes. It's totally new 100 yes. percent new okay <laughs> so and one of the I, I i tell you now uh one of the news for the next season when we hope we can open yeah. uh, also we have a dj box inside the bathroom okay yeah Why? in a hall okay. we have a very big um, hall for 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 uh, washing the hands, uh, men and, and women, yeah. and uh, there is a place to dance where, while the people is waiting to go to the toilet. So you have like an area of which they're waiting Same to like, the for example, in High in Ibiza. Yes. Yeah, they have yes. the same system. Ah, very good. Okay. Now, what kind of artists are you going to have? Can you tell us or is that a uh, Yeah. Um, now it's difficult to tell you because I were working with the artist uh, for this summer. Yes. Finally, we cancelled it all because of it was not possible. Of course, yes. My idea is not that the people come in because the artist. I want to have I want to have a very good uh, resident DJs yes. and sometimes big names. Okay. But I want the people coming because of the club. Yes. Not because of the artist. Yes. The artist it will be a supplemental. Yes. A complement. Yes. You know, but not the main uh, attraction. attraction. Yes. Um, we were speaking with uh, Jonas Blue, uh, with uh, Martin Solveig, Bob Sinclair, um, These do those names. Yes, okay. More or less. And with the downstairs, because there's a rumor that the old BCM yeah. is going to shift downstairs into See? Millennium. Millennium. And, yeah, what's happening there? Okay, at the moment we clean it the face. Yeah. But uh, yesterday I were speaking with the owner. And uh, he was uh, checking how is the new BCM now. And uh, his idea is now we make another project to make also new the, the millennium. Yes. Uh, because now it's, it's true that the two areas or the two floors are very, the difference is, yes. is, is big. Okay. So we, we are working now uh, to make a new project also for the for the millennium for okay. the for the so club that's is not going to be where the old BCM as it was goes. It's going to be something new. No, no, totally new. Okay, so everything you said sounds wonderful. Can you tell us more about the VIP? Because obviously the VIP used to be just a small area with some couches. How is that now? Now we have uh, four different VIP area in okay. the club. Uh, one 
is uh, around the DJ box. Okay. So there are so many people who like to be uh, there yes. because they like to be in contact with the DJ, uh, with the star. Um, we have another VIP area on the left side when you go inside, uh, on the left. And uh, there is for the people who like to order f a bottle, but they cannot spend this much money. Like when, for example, you want to be near the DJ. Yes. Um, we have another VIP area in the first floor in front of the, of the stage and also in front of the DJ box, the main. And uh, there is for the people who like privacy. Okay. You know? Yeah, to be private. Yes. To be private. Yes. Yeah. Uh, football players, um, people from Arabia. Or yes. They, 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 they like to see everything, yes. but not the people uh, see them. Yes. Uh, and after we have another VIP area just in front of the stage. Okay. Um, different prices, different options for all pockets. That's great, yes. You know, yes. Uh, yes. but uh, I want the people when they go there, they, they can find uh, their own place where they feel comfortable. Yes. That's, that's uh, now there are many different places in the club. Yes. And that's important because before it was all same and for mm, people who really don't uh, want uh, to be in a VIP area because they don't want to spend this yes. much money. Obviously, there's a lot of restrictions this year, so I'm not going to talk about that. Next year, if everything's okay, mm -hmm. when are you planning to open for all the people that are going to be watching? Assuming everything's okay, when would you like to open? Um, are we looking at March, April, May, June? I think uh, at the beginning of April. If all goes well. Yeah, yes. if everything goes well. Okay, because I think a lot of people will be excited. That's why I want to go. Yeah, to not it. before, because um, it's difficult. Maybe we can open for the resident people, but only weekends or um, Saturday. Yes. That's something we need to decide with the time, just when we know how we can to open. Yes. Because I think uh, a big club and new club like PCM now deserve a big opening party. Yes. So if we cannot to make this big opening party, better to wait. Yes until the moment we can do that. And do it properly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to stop talking about BCM now and talk a little bit about you. Yeah. Um, now, a lot of people know you for your fashion. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and especially a lot of my friends because uh, we have a lot of mutual friends, even uh -huh. though we've never met before. And the one thing that I have in common is all my friends who love their fashion love you. Uh -huh. And they all say, hi, Miss Lovely. Hi, Miss Wonderful. Oh, I love the way he dresses. So is fashion a love for you? Um, I, I like, I, I love fashion, okay. you know, this is a, a part of me, very important part of me. Um, that's my mentality, my, my, uh, you know, I always go somewhere, I travel, I go somewhere, I maybe see a, a t-shirt or a shoes or wow, I need to buy, Yeah, you know? Yeah. And I always think, uh, okay, this shoes is because this trousers, because this uh, t-shirt or this shirt or, you know, and yeah, this is my um, way to be. Okay, <laughs> who's your favorite designer? Uh, for example, I like, uh, I, I, I like very much uh, Dolce Gabbana. Okay. Dolce Gabbana. Uh, before it was my favorite uh, Cavalli, not now. Yeah. Not now, I think uh, it's, it's changed it. And uh, I have all markers. I think all, all they have something special. Yes. You know, and uh, Armani, Versace. Not now Versace, I like before. Yes. Versace, the, the, the old style. Okay. Uh, now um, I think they change it. Uh, and I don't know, and and uh, for sure I like La Boutin. Uh, yes. Yes. So you're not limited to one. No, 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 no. I always buy what I like. Okay. <laughs> doesn't, doesn't matter the. Well, with that, the is there any? Do you buy uh, anything from designers here on the island? 
Uh -huh. Or are you aware of any designers here on the island that mm, maybe caught your eye? The designer of the island are not are not my style. Okay. So I don't buy um, of these no, designers. Sorry. But is there a tailor that you use here, maybe on the island? Y yeah, I have a tailor. Okay. Yeah. And is he Palmer based? Can you tell us details about the? It, it, the, the, the store or yes. is in Palma. Okay, yes. but you're not giving away the name. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, thank you very much for your time today. You're welcome. It's been a to it was a pleasure you. to be here with you. And uh, the best of luck when it opens. Yeah, thanks a lot. Uh, I hope it will be very soon. And uh, we have a very great uh, summer because this is past and uh, is forgot. And yes. But uh, hope, uh, hope it too. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. So you're welcome. I want to say thank you to all our guests. It's been another great episode. And now it's part for the music part of the show. Live for you now, this is Albie. We've been going through some ups and downs. Sometimes it feels like we will not make it Find it hard to reach the common ground Still I know we got a good thing Have our moments and we have our phases Hard to let go, it's hard to face it Find each other just to make a change But you stand by me when it counts the most, show me love Never leave me lost with what you got Without conditions, oh, and that's why I hold on to you, I hold on I hold on to you, I hold on I hold on to you, I hold on And that's why Without saying words, you bring the sunshine when I'm feeling the blues. With you by my side, I know I can't lose. Cause I know we got a good thing. Every day brings yet another battle. But together we always get through it. Say you hate me sometimes, but that's cool. Cause you Stand by me When it counts the most Show me love Never leave me lost With what you got Without conditions Oh, and that's why